guess how are you feeling to finally get the season underway and be a crusader come Friday night? Yeah, exciting. Um, it's been a big preseason and um, a big move for myself um, down here. So uh, it's it's really exciting and a, and a game to, to look forward to. We last spoke to you a couple of months ago, but how have you found the preseason and getting, I guess, immersed in this culture here at the Crusaders? Good. It's it's um it's been a really uh, good preseason preseason um, something I've never really experienced before um, and yeah so uh, the trip over to the UK was was good um, one out of one out of two and a lot of lot of bonding with the players and, and getting to know everyone so um, it's good on and off the field for us. You say something you've never experienced before. Can you elaborate on that? Like, what is it for you that's taken it that level up? Um, I guess the. The knowledge of, the, of of rugby in the game, um, the coaches have been really helpful, and, and you know they're, 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 all, they're like teammates. So, pretty feel, uh, feeling pretty pretty tight with them to being able to, to talk to them about all that sort of stuff, um, and also just some of the activities we've been able to, to, to do in the off season, a bit of rowing and, and stuff like that. So, and a trip away over to the UK. So, um, it's been really nice. You really made a name for yourself in Super Rugby this year. You're excited by perhaps what you could achieve in 2024 with this extra guidance. Definitely, yeah. Um, you know, I think I've got all the resources here um, to really improve my game and, and develop as a player um, on and off the field. So, yeah, looking forward to that. Before that Northern Tour, you said you wanted to match fitness out of those games and yep. potentially lose another couple of kilos. Did you get what you wanted out of those games? Physically? Yeah, yep, definitely. Um, yeah, got a got a bit of time over there, um, and it's a different style of play over there. So, um, probably not as much. Um, Running, a running game for, for me as, as I wanted to, as a kick a lot, but um, yeah, got what I wanted out of that. Crusaders Chiefs over the years has been, last few while has been one of the biggest rivalries in Super Rugby. What's it been like to start this week for you, you know, starting the next week? Uh, yeah, nerves are a bit all over the place at the moment. Um, yeah, just really um, grateful to, to be named to start. Um, but yeah, I know it's, it's going to be a big game. It's always, always a big game between Chiefs and Crusaders, so. Um, I know they've got a, a great side, um, even though they've lost a, a few of their experienced players. Um, yeah, I know they've got a bit of depth there to, to match it, so excited. Will, Will Jordan injury obviously this week, so there's some big news yesterday yeah. coming out. Has, has he still been around um, since, since the word, or yeah, you know, are you expecting him to still be around? Yeah, I mean, really, poor Joe, I've pretty gutted for him, uh, like all, all the other boys are. Um, but yeah, he's, he still shows face around here, and. Brings all the, um, I guess, some tips and, and guidance for the boys. So it's been nice to have him. What was that first team naming like? I mean, and did people make a big deal of it, especially for you guys that are getting your first run out for the Crusaders on Friday? Yeah, it was. Um, yeah, the, it was a bit of clapping going on uh, for the for the debutants. Uh, I think Rivers and myself um, for, for starting, but yeah, they they come and give you a pat on the back and, and say congrats. Uh, afterwards, so it's, it's a really good feeling. Yeah. So I just got one. I haven't seen the Chiefs team yet, but yep. a guy like Anton Leonard Brown been yep. around a long time in, in the midfield, like real crafty midfielder. Yep. Like how how key is sort of nullifying his impact on the game for you? How much detail goes into his game? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, he is a you know he's a great player, and um, I guess you know he, he does all the basics really well. He, he is quite quick, and I've really got to got to stay on him for the full eighty. Or however long it takes, um, get up in his face and really um, work with, with Dallas, who's my inside, to, 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 to close off or to, to um, I guess, put a lot of pressure on those on their midfield if he is playing. So, yeah, he's going to be, he is a tough player and he's, he's got all the skill sets to, to really break, break a defence. Mm.